memorize committed to the hard disk, right? Yeah. So it's here swap, we go. Swap space. Yep. Yeah. Tell me when. So we start on the D minor pentatonic and blues scale here, mixed with Dorian. Uh, we have a root. We have a fifth. We have a thumb up here, and a flat seven. So we have to be able to do this without really doing that. So it started on the second string only. Right? Snappy. So you instead of a no. You wanna hear. Uh, snap that string up. And then he just shakes it. And since we're here, now our index finger falls right on the flat 7. <laughs> Snappy and staccato. <laughs> this one barely exists. Or maybe it's just one and I'm confused. And then we have this lick now. Exactly the same twice. Right? And now the ending. Which is the same note as this here, but it's also found here. soft almost non-picked super soft so and then we have this one that uses the root flat seven sixth the sixth is also known as the Dorian note in some circles so uh, this is the Dorian note and this is the minor third they together make the tritone so a slow, tiny band, slow and tiny, snappy. I don't even know if he did, if he did, it was so short that you could barely hear. And again. So the ending is. the five chord which is here root D four chord is the the G and the five chord is a but you can put the ninth and that notes the fifth so it, if you don't play the root you just get this by itself this chord is known as either mainly the minor seven flat five or the minor six, or the dominant nine. Same chord. In this case, it is functioning as a dominant nine. Mm. So this we're, so. Whenever you do this to a dominant chord, the name of that is called tritone substitution. Mm. We'll get there eventually. Now when you get the chord and you go half step up and and then you go and resolve to it. I like it. And it's a super cool chord it to is. in, in its it. own. So strong, not so strong. And then he'll start singing.